Hello my foodie friends and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I certainly appreciate you stopping by. So here in California, one of our favorite restaurants to go to is Texas Roadhouse. Now it's about 45 minutes away, so we don't go there often, but when we do, we always love to get the deep fried pickles. But ever since they started putting the calorie count on the menu, it kind of takes away the fun of ordering them because they're like 900 calories. So today I'm gonna show you a recipe that's just as good for at least half the calorie count and those are air fried, deep fried pickles. So let's get cooking. So the ingredients you're gonna need are of course dill pickle chips. Now if you can, try to get the refrigerated ones. They're a lot more crispy and fresh tasting and most stores always have them. We're gonna need some freshly grated Parmesan cheese, some flour, some breadcrumbs. I prefer to use the panko because those give a more crunchy texture. You're gonna need some uh, of your favorite seasoning salt. Today I'm using Uncle Steve's Gator Shake and two eggs. So that's all you're gonna need. Start with your two eggs in a bowl and we're just gonna give those a nice little whisk. Your owl whisk. With my cute little owl whisk. Then I'm just gonna take two paper plates and put our flour in one, along with a teaspoon of your favorite salt seasoning. And then in the other one, we're just gonna put our freshly grated Parmesan cheese and our panko breadcrumbs. And just give those a mix. Now this is gonna make about 20 pickle slices, um, depending on the size of the slices. So the first thing we're gonna do um, is dredge each one in our flour and shake it off and then dip it in the egg and then into the panko cheese mixture. And I like to kind of smash the coating on there really well so it has a nice amount. And then I've um, sprayed my air fryer pan with some cooking spray and we're just gonna lay those on there. I like to use one hand for my dry ingredients and then my left hand for the egg. That way your hands don't get as goopy. Here they are, and I have my air fryer preheated to 375, and I'm gonna cook these for 10 minutes, and I'm gonna flip them over after five minutes. Now, right before you put them in the oven, just spray the top with a little of the cooking spray. Okay, you guys, it's been 10 minutes. I flipped them over halfway through, and I sprayed the other side, and this is how they came out. I think they look amazing. They seem super crispy. Um, so I'm gonna try one for you. Okay, you guys, you know what time it is. Time for me to give this a try. Now we like to dip ours in either some yum yum sauce, which is sort of just like mayonnaise and chili sauce together, or ranch. So let's try a bite. Very crunchy. They are very, very crunchy, which I love. And you definitely get the dill pickle taste, but it's not too sour because um, what I did with the pickle chips was I dried them really well on a paper towel to get a lot of that juice off. And then when you um, fry them, you get that nice cheesy taste. They are really good, you guys, and they're gonna save you a ton of calories versus deep frying them. So I hope you're gonna give these a try. If you do, let me know. I thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and we will see you on another episode. Bye everybody.